Okay, time to talk about root cause analysis. Can we find the source, the origin of an, of an issue in our systems by using AI ops, by leveraging machine learning? We certainly can. Um, and I have not chosen the open telemetry demo just because it would me it would save me uh, development time, right? We have 11 microservices in there. Uh, but we also have something else. You, you might have noticed, if you are following along and you are deploying that in your own infrastructure so you can try it out, and I really hope you do that, uh, you might have noticed that along with the UI, when you apply the Helm charts, you will get another thing that's called feature flags. UI and that allows you to actually trigger a problem when fetching a specific product in that store um, but the, doc the documentation does not uh, say what uh, uh, what problem is that and actually the, the UI doesn't say what what product is this we'll have to we have to find to, f to find it right so let's go to our terminal so when you when you apply by using helm install or helm upgrade when you apply the the values right you will get that message Yeah, you will get feature flags UI, right? Let's port forward and then access the feature flag UI. Good, and then we have product catalog failure, fail product catalog service on a specific product. Hmm. It doesn't tell you what product it is. But let's just enable this and now let it fail for I don't know maybe 10 minutes and I'll go back why would we do that let's go back to our APM last 30 minutes and you will see um, Our feature flag service in here, it start, it will start triggering, and that failure most likely. Uh, feature flag service here, so that's that failure, and failure in that service will propagate, hopefully to up to the load generator actually. Uh, right because the load generator is kind of interacting with our systems with our microservices and if feature flag fails uh, then then hopefully other services will fail as well okay I'll let this run Well, actually, fail transaction rate is already so it's already failing. Actually, <laughs> this might be zero point two percent in fail transaction rate right here. Hmm. Let's see. So root cause analysis is all about uh, finding the source, right? the root of the problem and in in our APM we do have distributed tracing and 
we can, we can see that this is spanning across several services. So front end and cart service. So that's one interaction that is coming, that is passing through several of those microservices. And then you, you will see, uh, hopefully, yeah, feature flex service. So this front end is accusing a failure in there and product catalog service our that we know we have triggered the failure in there it's failing right uh, it's already telling me what product is failing but can I know for sure that the fa the failing transactions are all related to this product we can find that out uh, with machine learning. If we go over, so this, this is the latency distribution of everything, all the traces that were captured for the front end. We can correlate latency, see uh, what fields are highly correlated with the traces that are, or with the transactions that are taking longer, or with the transactions that are failing. If I click fail transactions, fail transaction correlations, it will find correlations uh, among, among all my transactions, those are the ones that are failing, right? Um, and there is a, high correlation with that specific product o l j maybe it might have the name in there but we have that that product in here right uh, yeah so all the so the failed the failed transactions at the front end right so at in the beginning of the transaction right the failed transactions at, at the front end are all related to this, right? Or for the most part related to this, right? 26% of uh, the transactions right now, they might be all failing at this precise minute, but since we are looking at last 30 minutes, so we have 26% of 26% of failure in there. And that's, because I know that already, that's precisely the product. Uh, open telemetry demo. Uh, if you go to the documentation of the feature flag service, if I'm not mistaken, let's see. Where is it? Oh, here, yeah, docs. <clears throat> so feature flex service. It's clicking the wrong thing. Uh, feature flex service. Yeah. Still not this one. Scenarios. Oh, it, it was right here. It was right here. So. Uh, Generate a product catalog error for get product request for that specific product, OLJ. So we can successfully, we could successfully, and not doing anything special, uh, correlate the failed transactions in the front end with that specific, um, with that specific product. And we have in the errors, we have it in there. Uh, well, that's just a group and fail to get product, that specific product right there. Um, so yeah, that error might be picked up by our anomaly detection as well if we have uh, 
if the failed transaction rate is raising, right? Failed transaction rate, it might get, let's just compare with expected bounds. Yeah, so my, uh, my machine learning job it will be, it will be uh, picking up chunks of, of that data. It might be uh, a little bit lagging behind, but it will pick it up. Yeah, it, it was a short video for root cause analysis. Um, we have shown uh, issue detection and root cause analysis as the main applications of of machine learning on, on, on for AI ops at least, right? And then the next video will talk about how we can actually act on top of those anomalies, right? Uh, and I'll let this run to see if that failure, uh, how that how does that failure would will appear in an anomaly, and then we can trigger an alert. Okay, so see you next time.